Hey guys, so today I just went to a store. I went to Home Depot actually, and I got picked up this bottle of Mod Podge, my first time ever using this. So I kind of tested it out with Elmer's glue, and I'll show you guys that how that turned out in a few seconds. But here it is. It got I got the gloss luster finish or whatever Mod Podge, um, 16 fluid ounces, and yeah. So if you guys want that, you can go to Home Depot and buy it. See, it's glue finish. And yeah, and this is what the label or whatever looks like. So it's pretty cool. I've never actually tried it yet, but I will try it on video with y'all next video probably. And tell you guys how I think of it. But for now, I'm going to keep this in the video probably just so you can see kind of the way back at the ground. So that, that you can see that. But I tried this out. I tried it out with Elmer's glue. Let me show you a bottle of it. Tried doing it with Elmer's glue. See that? So I tried it out with Elmer's glue. And this and all I did, and here's the bottle. I just took some I took an empty bottle and I put some of that glue into here. I added same amount of water with glue and mix that I shook it up and then I added some acrylic paint here's the acrylic paint I used so you cannot see that but here's what it looks like so I used that and then I put water I did half 50 50 water glue in this bottle mixed it up put some paint in here um, it depends on how dark you want your um, glue or your uh, DIY Mod Podge to be, but how light or dark you want your color to be, but that's what I did. Here are some of my finished products I did, and this is actually, I'm not sure you can tell, but this is actually a, um, oh, let me just try to find it, um, this is actually metallic. So let's see, let me show you my lighting different to see if you can see that. Um, metallic. Blue sapphire number is six five six. So it is metallic. You can also sorry about the light, I'll turn it back wait after I finish showing you guys. But then you can also buy um acrylic paint. And you can tell this is not acrylic this is not um metallic because again the label is not as shiny and it says all and all it does say on the label it says green, it doesn't say metallic paint on it but this is the folk art brand so if you want to go to Hobby Lobby or Michaels they have it there and it's, it works pretty good works really good actually it's actually really good it's probably one of the top high-end ones or whatever I don't know but here is the, what it turned out this is a piece of paper I'll show you guys the before paper what it looks like before so here's what it looks like sorry I'll just turn the lighting away maybe that'll work okay here's what it looked like before it was just plain old white piece of paper over here brightly actually and then here's the after mask, or after, what it looks like. So you can tell, it does look really nice. I like it a lot. This is actually just with Elmer's glue. This isn't with Mod Podge, so this is actually just with using this Elmer's glue brand. Nothing special. So it turned out pretty good. So that just tells y'all, if you do not want to go buy Mod Podge, you can just use Elmer's glue paint and water and mix that up and it turns out perfectly fine this is probably just matte finish it's not even glossy you can probably add some cheap glossy finishing paint or whatever to it and it'll gloss it up but yeah so this is what it looks like at the end so but next video I will be showing you guys what this does how it works I, again I'm I've not even opened it yet, I'll show you guys that. Twist the lid up, and there is a seal for your protection. So I've never actually opened this yet. As you can tell, the seal's still sealed up in the bottle. So I'll get to that later in some a next upcoming video. So I'll be looking for that, and maybe we'll do some crafts with it. So see you next time. Bye.